Hey, what's up everyone? This is Paul from The Daily Dose. As usual, more updates for today. Tons of stuff going on right now in the diecast world. So, I hope you will enjoy the show. Let's start this episode first with some new cars from Tarmac Works. They are available for pre-orders right now. And uh, yeah, they have seven all-in-all all new cars. Uh, when will this be... Uh, available i i have no idea the exact date when this will be out but again pre-orders are available let's start with the brand new one first uh mercedes-benz sls amg coupe black series and this one has like a chase variant again look at that just tremendous looking car not really popular casting i'm surprised by that one but yeah godly that's beautiful right there i don't know what the color is for the chase maybe you have some ideas let me know in the comment section below and also uh yeah another f1 race car right here the mercedes amg f1 w13 e performance uh this was raced in sao paulo gp back in 2022 driven by lewis hamilton yeah real popular driver of course and uh Tomark works has a lot of f1 race cars and i think they're the, the the cream of the crop in that one so yeah this one must have four collectors of f1 race cars out there they also have this i love the colorway on that one love the livery the renault 5 turbo man that is an amazing looking rally car right there shit look at that <laughs> just outstanding details on that one i cannot say uh, anything uh else about that one but it is beautiful next right here mercedes-benz 190e 2.5 evolution 2 again i love the livery i love the colorway and just a lot of uh that goes on that one and tons of amazing details also and probably one of my favorite uh cars in this wave right here the rwb rwb backdate that is an outstanding looking car i love porsches out there and man yeah yeah that is awesome i hope i can find one though uh from resellers since we don't have official uh tarmac works distributors here and next up this is again Tarmac Works IXO collaboration, a Ferrari 458 Italia GT3. Uh, yeah, that is awesome. Got Monster Energy right there. That's pretty neat, also. And next up, we have the Opel Kadat GSI. And this one has a Chase variant, also. So, stock looking car, stock wheels. Again, I have no idea what the Chase will be uh what color the chase will be in but yeah that is amazing so uh if you are uh looking for some new cars from tomac works go ahead pre-order them since uh deadline will be just in two weeks so short span right here so you better check them out in your favorite uh online sellers and we have more updates from Matchbox, a couple of sneak, sneak peeks here and uh, yeah, from main lines, also from moving parts set. And uh, here's the first one, the yeah, new colorway of the Honda Civic CC and uh, yeah, really cute casting. I do like that one in blue and it's one of my favorite Matchbox castings out there. Next right here, we have the uh, Moon Eyes 1933 Ford Coupe. And that one is, uh, yeah, that casting, the uh, 33 Ford Coupe is a matchbox staple. Yeah, it is a good one. Uh, not really that popular here from where I live. But again, a lot of collectors here just go after JDMs. They, uh, yeah, a few people just uh, appreciate uh, the, the cars that are not JDM. But yeah, I like this one, Moon Eyes Livery. That is really cool. We have right here the Matchbox Field Car. That one is awesome as well. I love that one. Kind of looks like a Ford Bronco. 
but yeah that it is not but yeah it is fantastic and next up really clean Porsche Cayenne right there with the, the moonroof sunroof also and that that is a cool looking car it's one of my uh, favorite looking uh, SUVs out there yeah it is gorgeous and I love the details on that one with the front right there with the headlights detailed tail lights also detailed uh, yeah absolutely nice looking car and uh, right here part of the matchbox moving parts set you got the Lamborghini Aventador uh, J so lovely details on that car also and you got opening doors for that one so that is really nice really fun uh, casting right there from matchbox tons of details on that one and right here a Mazda RX-8 can just talk not really uh, the best looking uh, car right here from from a Mazda still my favorite one would have to be the, the RX-7 but yeah I just I just don't like the form factor of the RX-8 I'm sorry <laughs> uh but yeah it is what it is and uh next right here probably one of the cars that i am most excited about the old uh autozam az1 we don't get that casting uh quite often even from other brands so that is really neat i just like that one a lot and uh yeah i, I have seen uh, some YouTube channels talking about the the real life Autozam AZ1. Uh, it has it is like gaining uh, sort of like a cult following. It is a nice looking car, quite tiny, but yeah, that is awesome to look at. And uh, also right here, updates from Hot Wheels. Yeah, we talk about uh, the the upcoming modern classic series. Uh, yesterday and uh, however uh, we didn't talk about the chase car and that set and the chase will be the 1998 Toyota Alteza so once again chase is number zero and uh, it is all black I'm really happy that uh, this is the chase because I think that is uh, again the prettiest car in the upcoming water classic series even though the civic eg will be i think the most popular but yeah for me that is the best looking car in that series and uh, also some main lines right here new main lines so we got yeah this is for next year by the way we got the drift and brake that is an unlicensed vehicle yeah uh, uh i don't know about that one not really loving the wheels not loving the form factor so what do you think of that uh, casting? <laughs> and uh, and lastly, check this one out. Uh, brand new recolor of the Batmobile. That one looks pretty cool as well. And uh, yeah, I might go after that one. I haven't bought like a Batmobile for quite a while. So yeah, I might buy that one. <laughs> so anyways that's today's update i hope you enjoy the show leave a like subscribe and see you on the next episode yeah it is a weekend go out and hunt and have fun and good luck to to all of you out there bye bye